Uh, hi everyone, uh, today I'm going to show you how to stop the black screen of death or the black crash while playing games or doing whatever. Um, as you can see this is a in, oh not in video, um, Toshiba Cosmio X305-Q701. This should work with other models as well. Um, for those of you who are experienced in black crash, um, this is basically the fix. Uh, currently, I'm running on one gig of RAM because uh, I fried my other my other sticks of RAM because of this laptop's overheating problems, which was due to GPU. Anyway, now I want to show you how to fix the black crash. This was the main problem with Nvidia, so. Um, people who are experience, experiencing these problems with other graphics cards, um, you should try this, okay. Um, first download River Tuner, so, River Tuner, type it on Google, go on the first link, uh, my camera's a bit out of focus, um, yeah, download River Tuner, oh, the internet's a bit slow, and just go to the download section right here. And just, and this should be a play. Uh, so it says, so it's most downloaded. This should be a place called RiverTuner version 2.24c. Download that onto your desktop. Um, extract it, install it. And once you install it, you should um, be onto a tab like this. Like that, um, God, this camera sucks. Anyway, um, you, you want to see your graphics card being detected on target adapter, but where it says driver settings over here, there should be something called customize. So click on that. There should be a little graphic card thingy just over here. My mouse, my mouse is hovering. Click on that, and um, you should. Uh, it should say something about detect now or something. If it doesn't, just leave it. Um, where it says over here, enable drive level hardware overclocking. Just click over here to enable performance 3D. Um, once again, enable performance 3D, and enable drive level hardware overclocking over here. Just leave the core clock and shader clock. I mean, I've seen other stupid people on other videos telling you to down clock the core clock and shader clock, but this is not a problem because um, through my diagnostics, the only problem this the graphics card is facing is the memory clock. There's the error, or it's been um, extra memory has been forced into the um, memory clock of the graphics card. So what you want to do is um, decrease it. Okay, the um the default memory clock is would be around about here with my mouse hovering and I shifted it to about here. Okay, and where it says over here, apply overclocking, make sure that it's ticked and click save. Or yeah, and just click save and apply and okay and just okay that part and reboot your computer and um yeah, everything should be fine. Oh, you don't need to, you don't really need to reboot your computer and just yeah, it should start up automatically. Yeah, but um, since I've done this, I have had no um black screen of death or black crash or whatever. I've been playing COD, Modern Warfare Two, um, Modern Warfare, COD Five. Yeah, I've been playing there for like three hours straight. Nothing has happened. So there's the fix and. Um, you don't need to do anything about core clock speed or anything, it's just, I don't know why people do it, I think they think it's to do with, uh, overheating, but with the X305-Q701, it hasn't got anything to do with overheating, but something to do with error in the memory, so, yeah, um, hope it worked for you guys, and, yeah.